This video clip is about mouse GPSs and you may ask why do they call them mouse GPSs? It's simple, it's because it looks like your mouse attached to your computer, not like the furry ones. Now there's two types of mouse GPSs. You've got your standard mouse GPS with the USB connector and then you've got your mouse with a PS2 connector. Now I'm sure you understand that with the USB that means it can be directly connected up to your laptop or to your PC. So what is the purpose of a mouse GPS with a PS2? Let's say for example you have a pocket PC, you want to run GPS software on it, but you want to have a GPS connected to it. The problem is with pocket PCs, they have their own special little uh, connector on them to connect to the outside world. So how do you connect a PS2 mouse GPS to such a device? Well it's simple, all you've got to do is buy an adapter cable. This one has a cigarette lighter cable or socket or plug, it also has the PS2 plug and also the plug to connect into the base of your pocket PC. Now be aware that all manufacturers and often models have different uh, base connectors. For example, HP base connector is different from the Asus or from the Dell or from the um, uh, iMate or the O2 etc etc. So when you go to order such a device, make sure you specify what brand and what model uh, pocket PC you've got. So what happens if you so des desire to connect your newly bought PS2 connector you use with your pocket PC with a brand new laptop that your wife just bought for your birthday? Well, it's simple. All you require is a special adapter cable with the PS2 connector on it and the USB connector on the other end. Straight away, you've turned it into a USB mouse GPS. Now, we've also got uh, a variation of the PS2 mouse. This is one made by GlobalSat. It has the PS2 connector and also got a serial or known as a DB9 connector on it as well. In the good old days, probably about five years or so, um, a lot of laptops and PCs would have the serial connection on the back. And therefore, you can turn it into a GPS device. Now, with this PS2 mouse, you can also connect it to, in this particular case, or this particular model uh, of Cradle, so you can immediately turn it into a mouse or GPS-driven uh, um, Cradle with your pocket PC inserted with the appropriate uh, adapter, base adapter to suit your particular pocket PC. Again, make sure you specify your brand and model. Now there are variations of um, mice uh, uh, GPS is available on the market, but be aware that you can't really call them mouse GPS. You, you will find, for example, this is a Bluetooth uh, GPS, uh, wireless GPS effectively. It does have a connector at the end of it, a miniature USB connector, but in most cases a lot of Bluetooth GPS only use it to power up and to charge the internal batteries. The M1000 by Holux um, does have the facility for transferring data through that port. So all you have to do is get a uh, cable to connect to it with a USB, USB connector at the end, plug it into your laptop and instantly you've got a mouse GPS. Other devices that can do that is this compact flash GPS and often you will use this device in a pocket PC with a compact flash or CF slot in the top or it can be used on a laptop in your PCMCI slot in the side but you do require a special sleeve that goes over this piece here. Now this particular GPS does have the miniature USB port as well so therefore you can turn this immediately into a mouse GPS if you so need to. Another device is this one, it's a data logger made by GlobalSat, it's the DG100. It uses batteries to, um, to power it. Uh, now data logging GPS is designed to allow you to travel to your destination, then download the track that you travelled onto your uh, laptop or PC and view the track, either through Google Earth or whichever GPS software that you may have. Now, um, you will find that there is uh, another type of cable 
This one has got USB connector on it, but it's got the male connector on the other end. You may require that for another type of um, GPS. There are uh, PS2 uh, GPSs with the female connector on the end. So you just got to make sure you just got to make sure you get that right. Now this is another device. Um, it is a Bluetooth device, meaning it's wireless, but it hooks into the cigarette lighter and it talks to your pocket PC or your laptop via the Bluetooth connectivity. Uh, it also has the same type of um, miniature USB connector like this um, HACOM HI-305 III and it too can be turned into a mouse GPS. Now all USB devices get their power through the USB connection on your laptop or PC. So in terms of power for this particular device, you don't need to have it uh, plugged into your cigarette lighter. You can use it with uh, an optional cable as a mouse GPS. That is